Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA Action on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here along with analysts Greg Anthony and Steve Smith. And we'll be hearing from D.A. along the sideline all game long. We've got the Los Angeles Lakers and the Chicago Bulls. So the Lakers win the tip. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. Grant is out there with Shaquille O'Neal. And it's Fisher. Then there's Kobe. And it's Fox in at the small forward position. And keeping his options open, Grant would rather give it away than waste the possession on a poor shot. Jordan against Kobe. The dish to O'Neal. He gets that one. Shaquille. The assist going to Brian. Kobe's been improving on that facet of his game. Outside, Rodman. Pippen feeling it out a bit. Jordan inside. Working on Bryant. The shot by Jordan. No good. Enzo Bryant will bring it up for Los Angeles. Four-point game. Fox dishes to O'Neal. And the dunk by O'Neal. And Fox's teammates love how unselfish he is, especially when they're wide right open. Bulls still looking like they're getting going. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. It's Pippen on the wing. Guarded by Fox. Six to shoot. Rodman kicks to Jordan. It's deflected. Right side, Fox. Pass to Grant. And the dunk oh, by Grant. Grant. And don't look Assist now, but Grant. they're starting to Good extend Fox. this lead. They're doing it by building it out, step by step, valuing each possession. The Bulls with another miss. The Lakers with a quick start to this game. Grant the pass to Kobe. A three ball. On lead, grabs the miss. And here are the Bulls now. Still without a basket in the game. And it's Pippen with the jam. Don't you wish you could leap like Pippen? I mean, I do. To the wing right side. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. A three from Bryant. They get it back. And O'Neal gets it to go. That's just staying in the moment. Keeping with the current possession. Outside, Jordan. Back to Pippen. Over Fox. And it's Pippen again missing. And here's the Lakers. They've gone on a 10-2 run, not allowing much. And here's Bryant for three. Launches a three. Again, the miss by Kobe. Bulls trailed by eight. Harper with the ball. For three, Pippen. Rebound the Lakers. O'Neal's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Fisher. And with his strength, Lapham Witness and that 7 3 wingspan, Pippen is an exceptional defender. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers holding on to an eight point lead heading into the break. And they've done a phenomenal job down low. So many of their points coming right at the rim. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And if you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter in this one. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. Establishing a paint presence early in the game, it really helps and pays big dividends down the line because it frees up your perimeter. And also have to bring up their passing game. They, they've been moving the ball with great precision so far and creating great looks for their teammates. So on the floor for the Lakers to start this second quarter, Shaquille O'Neal is out there with Grant. And it's Fox. Then there's Derek Fisher. And it's Bryant in at the two spot. You see the number of moves Kobe has more than capable of creating for himself with that hand. Jordan kicks to Kerr. Outside, Kukos. Back to Kerr, to the inside. From down in the low post, it goes. 
He's going it inside for one. Steve Kerr switching it up a little bit. And that was the Mobile One Drive. Well worth a second look. And no quit. Just keep playing the right way. Stay aggressive and try to battle back. There's Shaq. Two minutes. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. O'Neal's got the lead up to 10 now for the Lakers. And he's not looking at the score. He's staying focused. And he's staying active. There's two things they rely on him for. Being competitive and bringing energy. Bushler's checked in for Chicago. It's your just over one minute has passed here in the second quarter. Outside, Kukos. Give him another hand. And the pass to Kerr. Here's Wennington. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That's on Shaq. Clearly foul. Chicago shoot their first free throws of the game. And that one falls, so he hits both of them. Because he knows he makes a living at the line, he invites contact and sometimes even initiates it. Goes back up, and it's finished off by Four, Grant as he lays it in. And very strong at just under seven feet tall. Grant loves using that to his advantage inside. Simpkins passes to Kerr. Here's Wennington. And no good. Shaq with some nice D. Los Angeles leading by 10. Pass to Fox. He feeds it to O'Neal. Kukoc with the steal. Pass to Bushel. Here's Simpkins. Inside, Kukoc. Second chance shot, and the layup is up and in. Kuko just got his first bucket of the night. Salvage the possession. He's a terrific offensive rebounder. To the middle. And there's Shaq. That's good on the assist from Kobe. Shaq's got the lead. Back up to 10 now for the Lakers. Kerr the pass to push him. Kuko against Fox. Down low. There's Simpkins, and he takes that one up and powers it through. Yeah, and what you love about the coach, the versatility on offense and the terrific court vision. A three from Bryant. Chicago grabs the miss. In this first half, he has really fallen in love with the three. So far, not paying dividends. Here's Kerr for three. Buries the long-range jumper. Kerr's got five. And that's his specialty. Curry is out there to space the floor for his teammates and knock down triple. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answer each other from range. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers in the driver's seat. Up eight points at the end of the quarter. Defensively, they have gotten after it, contesting every shot going up. We've got more in store for you right after this. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to 2 It's the Lakers out on top at halftime. They have a solid eight-point lead. Shaq, what was your takeaway on the Lakers? Well, they've shown a lot of discipline the offensive. It's not about getting quick shots, it's about getting quick shots. And if you want to know how that approach is working, you check out their field goal percentage. And Kenny, let's get your input on the Bulls. They got hammered. I mean hammered on the ball. That's that tells a lot about the game. No. And for those of you just tuning in, thanks for being with us. The second half of this game is still to play. Really an incredible game from Shaquille O'Neal. In those first two quarters, he was pretty much an automatic bucket getter if he got it down low on the block. I have to credit them for their patience offensively. They understood the matchup, and they took the necessary time to exploit it. We've got Longley. Harper is out there with Jordan. And it's Dennis Rodman. And it's Pippen in at the three slot. And that's the group for Phil Jackson as we begin the second half. O'Neal 
fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. First personal foul. And the big guy is doing big things offensively. O'Neal knows his team counts on him to rack up points. Here's Harper. Here's Rodman, and it's sent back by O'Neal. Fox passes to O'Neal, and Shaq with the slam. This is Shaq at his best, getting that deep position and then just muscling through. Pippen kicks to Hart. And here's Jordan outside. It's not going to go for him. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Pass to Grant. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. And O'Neal gets it to go. I couldn't tell if they tried to foul Shaq there, but didn't matter. Chicago calls timeout. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. It's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. And a wide open look for Jordan. And that comes off the assist by Longley. It wasn't really a long distance shooter in college. Jordan really worked on his range ever since being drafted. And O'Neal gets it to go. Man, just adding insult to injury. He just waltzes inside and extends this lead. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. Fisher dishes to Bryant. Here's Shaq, and it's blocked. And three from Jordan. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. O'Neal's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Pippen against Bryant. No good on the three. Just not feeling it from beyond the arc. Sometimes that happens. He's trying to shoot Los his way out of it. And there's the call on Derek Fisher. First That's his first foul. foul. Some changes first for Chicago. Kukoc, he's checked in for Long. Substitution. And Steve Kerr is subbed in for Harper. Pippen, the pass to Rodman. Inside. He got it, and the Laker lead has been cut to just 11 points in the basket from Jordan. A high percentage look for Jordan. It has every move you could ask for in the painted area. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. First personal foul. Yet another bucket in close. That's how he's earning his points today. The Lakers have shot just one free throw, missing that one early. The free throw off from O'Neal. Over seven feet, big, quick, great hands. Shaq is a one of one type of player. Jordan passes to Rodman. Shot from 12. That one's good. The Laker lead is cut down now to just 11 on the basket from Michael Jordan. Bryant looking over the floor. Shaq kicks to Fisher from the arc. Rebound by Pippen. For three, Kerr. The second chance effort, and the basket is good. And he's got a chance here for one more at the line. Yeah, pound for pound, inch for inch. Robin may be the most dominating rebounder we've seen. Instinctual, athletic, and relentless. And it's out of bounds, and they say that's touched by Bryant. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. Yeah, quick thinking pays off big. What a block. We've watched three so far in this one. Lakers lead by nine. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter right here on 2K Sports. 31. And let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game. And he, he may not be known as a pass-first guy playing out of the two-guard spot, but he shows here that he can dole out an assist or two when he needs to. Whatever the offense requires, that has to be your mindset. Always thinking team first the fourth quarter has arrived so good to have you with us 
And so Fox will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. So for the Jackie Lakers right now, we've got Ori. Ryan is out there with Fisher. Kobe then it's O'Neal. And it's Fox in at the three, the small four. Harper dishes to Pippen. Pippen is doubled. And wrestling for it there, but no one has ball. possession. We'll have a jump ball. It will be a jump ball. And so it's the Lakers with it. Lakers leading by 11 to the inside. O'Neal. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three point play chance here for him. It's a tall challenge trying to contain Shaq, especially when he's operating close to the basket. The free throw off from O'Neal. Here's Chicago. Pippen down low. Guarded by Kobe. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Now the pass to O'Neal. Here's Fisher. He shoots again, and Shaq puts Shaq it in. Shaq's got six points in the quarter. Uh, the strength of O'Neal uh, is otherworldly. Harper the pass to Rodman. Pippen gets to Rodman. Remaining in the game, two minutes. And there's the call on Derek Fisher. That'll be his second foul of the game. Mad City's checked in for the Lakers. First team foul. Coming on to the floor for the Lakers. Fourth quarter still young, just over a minute play. Here's Rodman. Trying to get open is Pippen. Here's Longley. And finished off by Longley. And just scrapes and claws for that offensive rebound and, and doesn't take any chances there with the put. G.A. strong work all around. And the rebound and the stuff bolt. Wow. And it's Medza missing. Bulls trail by 13. Pippen with a wide open look. Wasted no time on that shot, but it's off the mark. The three from Bryant. And they get it back. Here's Fisher. Drills it from outside. Derek Fisher. And the Lakers lead by 16. Well, credit them for maintaining that aggression, even being up this much. They don't want to leave no chance for a comeback. Just focus on playing the right way. Clearly, he's one of the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. That was a second look at our Mobile One Drive. Amazing control on display. And putting that pressure on his rim. That's what it's all about. Threatening with that attack. Yeah, they can count this one in the win column. It has been a tremendous effort. I love what we saw from them tonight. And I'm sure they'll try to replicate it next time out. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Shaq. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. He silenced this crowd with an unreal display. His ability to drown out the noise and the hostility of an opposing crowd is pretty special. Passes it to Bushley. Oh, no good on the triple. Here's Los Angeles now. They're on a 12 to four run. Fisher, the pass to Fox. And another three for the Lakers. Inspired tonight. They fought hard and at crucial points just made the plays especially during this last run, which ultimately put the game away. And there it is for him. And that solid play in the paint continues here, guys. Pass to Grant. 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Shaq. It's tipped. Here's Brown. Out to the right wing. Missed inside. 
and so it's the Lakers taking care of business here. That's this one was over game. well before the final buzzer. The fans were oh, waiting for something to get excited about Greg, but they never got it. Tonight. They sure did. I mean, they just rolled to this win. They made it look really easy. What an efficient performance at both ends. And that about wraps it up for Steve Smith, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. So long, everyone.